Hello champions and welcome to It's Donnie Time. I want to welcome you all. I hope you're having a wonderful holiday. Um, today is Labor Day. It's the holiday weekend and hubby and I are just chilling. Um, we're not having any guests over. All the kids are doing their own thing today. So we put a little something, something on the grill. I made a little, couple of little sides. He's outside doing his thing with the grill because that's what he loves to do is sit outside and grill. And I just decided I wanted to come in here because I was playing in my makeup and I just wanted to come in and say hello. And also, I picked up six of the new Amare what is it called? Amore Matte Liquid Lipsticks by um, Milani. And so I just wanted to swatch and let y'all see what these are all about. I only picked up six, I think, oops. I think there's like maybe 10 colors or maybe 12 colors or something like that. But I only picked up the fall colors that intrigued me and looked like something that I would wear. So these are the darker ones that I picked up. And then these are more of the nudie line that I picked up. So if you want to see swatches and just get a feel for what these are, um, I've tried to film this video twice now trying to do live lip swatches and my lips were just destroyed. So I won't be able to do lip swatches today. But um, if y'all want to see some lip swatches, let me know in the description box down below, down below and maybe I can split up three and three. You know what I'm saying? Because it's, it's awful on the lips when you try to do live lip swatches. But anyway, check me out. Hang tight. Okay, guys, so we're going to go ahead and get started. So like I said, I picked up six of the new limited edition um, Milani Amore Matte Lip Liquid Lipsticks. I only picked up six colors um, and they're pretty much more fall appropriate. So we're going to go ahead and get, get to swatching with these. Now I'm going to be using my trusty little magnifying glass here because my glasses I seem to see a glare going on. So um, and I don't want y'all to be concentrating on a glare. So um, we're going to get started. So the first one that I have here, it's the number 28. Oh Lord, I can't even see with the magnifier. And it's called Darling. Okay, and that's what it looks like. And we're gonna swatch it. Very pretty pinky nude. These, it's very opaque, not streaky at all. And that's what I really, really like. And so there you have that color right there very pretty very pinky nude i'm going to probably really enjoy wearing this one but that's number 28 darling then the next one we have is number 29 and it's in the color sweetie s-w-e-e-t-i-e -E -E. oops i didn't show you what it looks like that is what the packaging looks like and y'all know Milani always has some very, very nice packaging. We're going to swatchy roo, swatchy roo. Again, very opaque, not streaky. And that is what Sweetie looks like right here. So they look like they're the same, but the first one, which is called, what was the first one called? Darling. It is, this is... Okay, let's see. Darling is right here. And it is a little bit more brighter pink. Whereas Sweetie, which is the second one right here, is a little bit more muted pink, I would say. But still and yet, very, very pretty color. Then moving on to the next one, it's number 31. And it's in the color Glamour. And that's what it looks like there. And we're going to swatchy roo it. And again, opaque, not real thick. Uh, very, very beautiful color. This is Glamour right here. Very pretty. Very, very pretty. And as a matter of fact, I have Glamour on my lips. I'm wearing Glamour now. 
so let me just come in a little bit so you can see but this is glamour yeah and I think out of the six that I got that this is my favorite color um, I'm gonna really 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 get a lot of good use out of that then moving on to the next one it's number 32 and it's called emotion emotion and that's what that looks like right there emotion Oh, it ain't focusing, so we aren't going to worry about it. But we're going to go ahead and we're going to swatch it real. Again, very opaque. That's what I like about these. They're opaque, they thin, and they're not streaky at all. And that is emotion. There we go. That is emotion. Yeah. Very pretty, very pretty. Then the next one we have is... You know what? Okay, I don't think I had my camera on autofocus, so we're going to see what happens. But moving back on into this swatch, this is number 37. No, we were talking about one, two, three, four. Lord, I done got lost. Okay, this was number 32, emotion. Right. And so emotion is right here, if y'all can see that. That's emotion. And now we're going to move into number 36, and it is called Magnetic. Now, these last three um, are really, really, really good fall colors. That is what the packaging looks like. And then we're going to do a swatchy roo, swatchy roo. Again, opaque, thin no streaking i'm just doing it a couple of times because i want y'all to be able to see the true color of it but that one is what did i say this one was number hmm here we go number 38 magnetic number 36 magnetic that's number 36 magnetic very 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 pretty i'm going to truly enjoy wearing these this fall and then the final one that i picked up is the number 37 dearest now this was 36 wasn't it yeah magnetic is 36 i'm sorry this is number 37 dearest and that's what it looks like there in the packaging very pretty color very deep burgundy red more of a vampy burgundy red and then there it is right there yes ma'am so we're gonna have fun 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 wearing these this fall and this winter and as you can see the top ones have already dried and actually they look really really well the one on my lip, which is this one right here. And it's, it is called, let me refresh my memory again. It's number 31, Glamour. And that's what this one looks like. Very, very pretty. It's got some metallic to it, but that's Glamour. And that's what I have on my lips right now. And what I can say about it, I haven't had it on. For very long at all but I can tell you that it has dried um, it doesn't feel thick it's very it feels very lightweight on the lip and I don't feel like I have anything on actually now it is a liquid lipstick and I'm sure it's going to dry my lips out but because I tried to film this video twice to do live swatches my lips were really really parched to say the least and so I heavily heavily hydrated them um, with a lip balm. Uh, actually, it's a chapstick uh, hydrating formula lip balm. Um, and so that could be the reason why, too, that they don't feel drying. But it doesn't feel drying at all. And I'm liking the application. I like how it looks on my lips. Let me know down below what y'all think of how this one looks on my lips because I am really, really, really digging this color. So yeah, so this is these are the six ones that I have. I just always dropping stuff. These are the six ones that I have. 
Like I said, these are all colors that I know that I would wear. And then here they all are swatched. The only one that isn't dry yet is the last one that I swatched, which was number 37. What was she called? Uh, let's see, what was she called? Dearest. So as you can see, she's still just a wee bit wet at the top, but all the other ones have dried. And I think they look really, really, really nice. Like I said, I am wearing one right now and it feels like I don't have anything on my lips once it dries. So I think that Milani, kudos to you. You did a very good job, in my opinion, with these new colors. Um, and with, seems like they changed the formula just a little bit. I don't know. I could be wrong. I'm no expert in this stuff. But... It just seems to be a little bit lighter on the lips, lighter feeling on the lips than the first um, set of liquid lipsticks that they released. So, that's it guys for this video. Short and sweet. I'm trying to get away from those longer videos. But y'all just bear with me because you know that a sister like to talk and tell you what's going on. <laughs> so, again... Thank you for tuning in. Take, thank you for taking the time out on your holiday to watch me. I truly appreciate it. To my new subscribers, thank you so much for subscribing to the channel. Please comment down below and let me know what you think about my channel. If you have any thoughts or ideas or any videos or reviews or anything that you would like to see. To those of you who just happened up on my channel, please click that uh, subscribe button down there at the bottom, you know, because then that way you will always be notified when I post a video. If you like my content, by all means, please hit that subscribe button. I truly would appreciate it. To my ride or die, y'all know how I feel about you. Thank you so much for tuning in. And until next time, smooches! Postscript champions, you're going to need you some oil to get these lippies off. Look at here. It, it, I'm regular makeup wipe is not going, it's not going to do it. You got to rub too hard, honey. You're going to need you some oil. And what I'm using is the Sephora Ultimate Oil and Gel Lipstick Remover. And that's what it looks like right there um, and it just takes a little dab of do ya and now I'm gonna use the makeup wipe but you see how it just comes right on off see there you're gonna need you some oil to get this stuff off your lips cuz I mean once it dries baby it is on for good. So you're going to need you some oil to get it off. And so I just want to come back because when I ended my video, I was trying to get it off my arm. And I was like, oh, hold up, hold up, hold up. <laughs> Let me go back on here and tell my champions they're going to need some oil. Coconut oil, Jehovah oil, any kind of good oil. Heck, Vaseline if that's all you got. But you're going to need some oil to break it up. So I just wanted you guys to know that. So smooches.